today we programmed a dancing robot. So let me uh, walk you through the program. So uh, start of the program. This is very interesting. In, in this program, we are trying to do two things at the same time. First, on the left hand side, we want to uh, program the coach robot to do a dance. And on the right hand side, while the robot dance, we also want to play a music. And let's let me go over the left hand uh, program and walk you what the robot, the coach robot, is going to do. So first, when the program starts, we have set a broadcast. Set a broadcast. All right. So when the dance routine is received by the left part of the program. The first thing that will happen is that the motor that uh, shortest path will be set to zero and that is for the motor F. So if you look here, if you look here, the motor F is connected here and the motor B is connected on the right hand, on the left hand side. So what will happen is that then the motor F when we set to zero position, if a robot is in any uh, other position like this, it will go back to the zero position. And how do we can how we can see that? If you look at on the back side, the motor if a, if a, if a leg is like this, then the if a motor is set to go to the zero position, it will go back to the zero position, which is here. So if a robot is like this, it will go back to the zero position. So this is going to be the zero position. The next. We will set the position shortest position on the on the B motor motor that's connected on B to 35 degrees, which is a little bit on the right side. So let me let me actually show you how it will look like. So let's uh, start the program and see what will happen. So I'll stop it here. So what's happening right now is. We have gone through these blocks. First, it set to position zero, and then it moved the B, which is this motor, which is this motor, to position 35. So right now, it's moved to right at 35 degrees. You can see that. And once it moved to 35 degrees, it will set the position for the other motor, which is on F, to 300 and 40 degrees. If you look at that, it's 340 degrees and look at its leg here. It's moved to 340 degrees. Next, we'll go into a repeat. And in a repeat, we'll basically move the motor B to turn left and right like this, about 0.2 rotations. And this is exactly what you saw earlier. Well, the, this leg started rotating like this. So this is this is our dance routine. And the next block is pretty much same. We're going to set it to position zero, which means that it will go down here. And then we'll move the other leg like this, and then we'll rotate the second motor left and, uh, and right about 0.2 rotation. And you can see that from this block. In parallel, while this happened, we'll also send the same broadcast to another programming block. So this is kind of like a parallel programming. So on the right hand side, we'll play a music. And in this case, we'll repeat it for uh, 10 times. And first we'll set the guitar. Uh, we will set the instruments to electric guitar and then play a note 30 for 0.5 beats. And then we'll play a note 67.5 beats and we can add more to make it more interesting and more fun so let's play the program from the start to the finish and see how the robot and the music our coaching robot looks like and one two three here we go Thank you guys.